In this video, I'll show you how to use DVD shrink to copy your DVD to your hard drive. First of all, you have to download the DVD shrink. After, after that, install to your computer. And then this is program after you install. So open the program. Now in the DVD shrink, click open disk. So assume you already have a DVD put in your DVD drive. So that's DVD already in your D drive. Click OK. And it will now the DVD shrink will analyze your DVD disc. It takes a little while. The size takes about six minutes. Depends how long is your DVD. So um, this is very important because it will analyze all the data and also how many language was the subtitle so in future you can choose which format to to copy so just be patient wait for a little while okay now you can see analyze is finished it will show you the detail about the DVD see the DVD is 2 hour, two hour 24 minutes long and there's some extra feature you can choose to with a selected feature now to save some disk space um, in this one there's only one English language so basically you just copy everything now if sometimes there's multiple language say Spanish or other language you can select or the uh, unselect so to save some space see this one for the, each audio using nearly 340 megabyte uh, file space so you can save some data if, if this is multiple language now when you're ready to start just click backup to copy the whole DVD to your hard drive so you can choose where to save to see now it's automatic say save to C drive and uh, the uh, title of the movie will create the photo automatic for you it will using 4 mig 4 gigabyte data 4 gigabyte hard drive space just make sure you got enough hard drive space then just click start sorry click, click OK then just click OK you can start to repin the DVD to back up to your hard drive now you can see this one it's take a little bit longer normally it's say this one say one hour 25 minutes 21 minutes it sometimes even shorter so just leave it and you can do something else and also you will notice when it's actually ripping the file your computer will become a little bit slower because all the resources using for ripping the DVD so it's better just leave it alone when wait until it's finished then you can do something else then after the ripping DVD finish what you need to do is using VLC media play you can use that to play the DVD from your hard drive not from the disk so open that and go to media instead of open disk using open folder and click that and go to C drive or where you back up your DVD find the DVD title highlight that and click select folder it will automatically open the file because the ripping still uh, keep doing on the background so it can't play it right now but if you if your rip, ripping is finished you should be able to open the whole DVD and just click here to play Thanks for watching. See you on next vhow.net video.